What's going on guys? Joey just Joey here and today I am back for episode number three of our sacred gold egg lock. Now real quick right before we start go down there and hit that like button if you're excited for today's episode and let's get started. Now let's go in for a party recap of uh, of the Pokemon that we have. So let's see, we have uh, Goku, the Adamant Sandshrew, somewhat vain, with Mudshot, Rock Slide, Swords Dance, and Counter, and Sand Veil to boost that evasion. Next up, we have Too Spoopy, the uh, Lax Ghastly that is often lost in thought, with Parish Song, Hypnosis, Nightshade, and Disable, with Levitate, because all Ghastlies in this game have Levitate. Alright, so, we, uh, we have these two guys, and uh, let's... Head on over to our bag to see what we got. We have the uh, the leftovers that we actually have to give to Goku, and we have some uh, we have some potions and an antidote. We have 15 Pokeballs, which means that our Nuzlocke egg lock has officially started. So once I step into the grass on Route 29, we're gonna catch ourselves a Pokemon to go to the PC and hatch one. And also, I have a uh, Giga Drain, which was given to Ghastly, so that Ghastly can learn Giga Drain. Alright, too spoopy, uh, let's see what move we're gonna get rid of. I'm gonna get rid of Disable. Because, I mean, I disabled a Growl, it's not really... My hat's crooked. Alright, forgot to use Disable and learn Giga Dream. Alright, I don't think we have anything else. Well, we have those. Okay. So, let's... Let's go on here, and let's run into this grass. And let's get ourselves our encounter, which, this is not going to be the Pokemon that we're going to use, but we're going to bring it to the PC and switch it out for an egg. Alright. Let's, let's weaken this Rattata a little bit. Hit it with a mud shot. Speed fell. Alright, it's a, it's a level 3 Rattata, you know. Got that, getting those leftovers, nibbling on that little apple. Alright, so let's go to our bag and let's throw a Pokeball. One, two, oh, oh, oh. I couldn't catch this Rattata. Alright. So. We get one health back for... For that. All right. Let's see. What else do we have? We uh, let's hit it with another mud shot. Got it in the red. Got it in the red. All right. The red is usually where you want to throw the pokeball. I was actually a little nervous about like critting and knocking it out or something like that. So let's go to our bag and let's use another pokeball. So it's going to be level 3. Alright. So whatever Pokemon we get is going to be, is going to turn into level 3. Rattata's data was added to the Pokedex. Okay. Okay. Alright. No nickname. Okay. So let's head over here. And actually up here. Up on... Uh, it'll, it'll be faster to go the other way, I think. Alright, so let's go over here. Oh yeah, it's a lot faster to go this way. And a lot less grass. So up at the top over here, there's actually another route so we can get another encounter. So we can have two Pokemon to switch in today. Oh, there wasn't even a tree there. I could have just walked up. I didn't have to go through grass at all. all right. So now let's run away and let's go in here. He says you can't climb ledges, but you can jump down from them and take a shortcut. Different kinds of Pokemon appear in the grass. If you want to catch them all, you have to look everywhere. All right. So let's go up here, and this is actually Route 46. All right. So let's go get our encounter. A new mole. That was honestly unexpected. I, I mean, we're not going to get a new mole, but I just wasn't expecting to see a new mole here, and we can't do 
anything, so let's send out two Spoopy. Because two Spoopy is Nightshade, and Nightshade can do five damage, so that's good. Five damage all of the time. Alright, so let's see how much... Nightshade does. Okay, we can hit it with a couple Nightshades. Alright. Okay. Alright, so we got that. Move my chair over a little bit so I can sit here. Alright. Hit it again with a Nightshade. Yellow. It's close. That's too close to call. I'm not gonna hit it with another one. I'm just gonna throw a Pokeball. Come on! Roll it! Roll it! Roll it! Click. Nice. So we have two Pokemon, so this is gonna be- this next Pokemon is going to be... Level 5. Okay. Alright! Not gonna give him a nickname, and... So let's talk to this person. You should try different routes sometime. You never know what Pokemon you're gonna get. Alright, let's... A Swablu. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I like Swablu. Alright, Altaria, Altaria is just, like, amazing. Alright, so let's go... Down. And we will go back to Cher... Cherigrove City? I'm mixing up my games now. I'm not sure what the city is called. I think it's called Cher... Sorry. I think it's called Cherry Grove City. I think it is. But we'll find out. Cherry Grove City. And Cherry Grove City... Let me uh, write this down. It's actually somewhere we can get encounter. Because if we go over here... To the water... We can go in our bag... And mom gave us an old, uh, the old guy gave us an old rod. So we get to fish. Land in a Pokemon. Alright, it's an old rod, so it's gonna be a low level, but it's a core fish. You know, I love Crawdont. I just love adaptability Crawdont. Oh, this isn't good. Let's get out of here. New one's holding an item. Oh, okay. I'll check out what that is. Uh, but... Okay, he's gonna use Harden. Oh, wait, he's level 10. I didn't even see that. Okay. Let's put him to sleep. To Spoopy, come on. Stop missing hypnosis! <laughs> Alright. Hit him. Okay. One more. Alright, good, good, good. One more and I was gonna send you to the... What's it called? You need glasses. Like the do the doctor that you need glasses. If you know what that guy, what the doctor that needs glasses is called, leave that down in the comment section below. I might make that the comment question of the day, actually, but let's hit it with another nightshade, or hit it with a nightshade. Hopefully he doesn't wake up and he doesn't hit us with, like... I don't even know what cor Corefish gets. I mean, it gets hardened, but I don't know, like, I don't know what it gets when it's leveling up. I just... I love, I love Crawdon. No, let's go to bag, Pokeballs, and let's throw a Pokeball. Try it out. Okay. Wiggle, 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 click. Nice. All right. So uh, we got a Pokemon that's going to be level 10. Fantastic. We're going to have a lot of encounters by the time we get to Violet City. Jeez. It was originally a Pokemon from... A far that escaped to the wild, it can adapt to the dirtiest river. But we're not even keeping it, so I don't know why I just read that Pokedex entry. I don't know. But let's go, uh, let's actually go over to the Pokemon Center. If I can go in the door. And let's go to the PC. Uh, let's move our items from our party Pokemon, because he is a Rost Berry. Which can heal a burn, which is good. Alright, so let's go back. Uh, no, let's continue. No, we're moving items. Never mind. Okay, 
So let's move Pokemon and let's go ahead and choose our next encounter. Our next Pokemon, that, our egg that we're gonna hatch. So let's see. It's gonna be row three. Ah! I caught it this time and it didn't go flying across the room. It's gonna be number four. Alright. Top Gun holding a lucky egg. Oh boy, I'm excited for that. So, Top Gun, uh, we're going to switch with our Rattata, which was level 3. So we're going to have Top Gun. I'm trying to think of like Pokemon that could possibly be named Top Gun, and the only Pokemon that's coming to mind right now is uh, Staraptor. Because I don't know, this, like Top Gun for Staraptor, the, the nickname just fits. So let's take this Lucky Egg away. All right, let's go down and let's hatch the egg. Okay, let's see what the Pokemon is. It is a Starly. <laughs> okay, I didn't look at the Pokemon, I, I promise. I, uh... All right, a male. I don't know why it's like it's changing the screen so fast, but we got Top Gun, the Starly. Okay, now um, okay, so uh, let's let's actually hold on. I'm gonna get away from the PC. Let's go to Pokemon. Let's go. Let's check out Top Gun. It is an adamant Starly. Uh, it's alert to sound, so its ears are working pretty well. Uh, it has keen eye, so it can never miss more. Uh, Double-edged pursuit, fury attack, and feather dance. Now let me actually go up and search up the egg moves for Starly. Um, I did it once again and I didn't have this open but let's go down to the egg moves okay let's see ah okay we have a uh, double edge double edge which is an egg move pursuit which is an egg move fury attack which is an egg move and feather dance which is an egg move a uh, slight sound malfunction there for a second uh, okay all right here we go. What's going on? All right. So we got that. All right. Cool. So Starly is illegal, 100% legal. Uh, let's get it up to level three. Level three. Level three. And we're gonna be giving it that rare, that lucky egg. So it's gonna be leveling up so fast. Okay. Top Gun was elevated to level three. All right. Cool. So let's go and get our second encounter, Pokemon, which, uh, let's see, was the Numal, which is level 5. Okay, so now I'm going to go, I'm going to do this so that we can't see the Pokemon that is hovering over. Alright, so row 6, there is a row 6. No, no there's not. There's not a row 6. So we got to roll again. Row 2, row 2. Number six. All right, we have something. I'm guessing it's Japanese. I'm not sure, but it has no item. So we're going to level up this Pokemon to level five. And we get to choose the nickname because I can't read whatever language that is. So let's go and run around a little bit and get the egg to hatch. Sometimes I just like, I just kind of. I press the button. Sometimes it likes to work, sometimes it doesn't. I'm not sure. We're running. We're running down the road. Trying to hatch an egg. Come on. There we go. Alright, we finally got it. So let's go ahead and see what this 
egg is... It's a Natu. Hmm, a Natu. What am I going to name a Natu? Alright, so let's give it a nickname. Male. You know what? I just see Blubber being the nickname of this Natu. So I'm gonna write down its nickname. Okay. And all right, let's uh, let's go and check out this Natu. Summary. Okay, it is naughty, a naughty Natu. Very finicky. It's got early bird, so it always wakes up fast. It's got confusion, air cutter, feather dance, and refresh. So let me go in and double check. Uh, Natu. Natu. Gen 4. Go down to the egg moves. Let's see what it has. It has confusion. Um, move the screen. Okay. Uh, confusion, which is... I don't see confusion. Am I just not looking in the right place? Alright. Air cutter. It's not there either. Hmm. Air cutter is a move to attack. Confusion it gets at confusion. Does Natu get confusion at all? I don't see confusion anywhere on this list. Hmm. Feather Dance is an egg move, and Refresh is an egg move as well, but I'm not seeing... Oh, sorry. Ah, let me start the music back up for you guys. Ah, pause, okay. Uh, let me... Okay, let me double check the documentation for this game. Um, because on Serbian Gen 4... Where's my... Where's the documentation for this game? Um... Alright. So, give me one second. Um... I'll cut ahead to when I have it. Oh, look how fast that was. Okay. Uh, we're gonna find... Evolution changes, item locations, Pokemon changes. Okay, I'm gonna go to Natu. It only goes up to level 100. That's so weird. Okay, so pause there. Okay, so what's gonna happen is I can't use this not to. I have to go back in the game. I can't use this not to, unfortunately, because I. I don't know. Let me move Pokemon. So let us get another. Encounter for the Natu. Alright, so three. Row three. And number six. There is a six. Okay. So I'm sorry whoever made me this Natu, but um, I can't find any of the moves to be learned. So unfortunately, it would be an illegal Pokemon. So I'm sorry, but I'm going to reselect it for this Pokemon here, which is a Gatorade. Alright, I gotta erase my Natu blubber. So its name is going to be Gatorade, and it's going to be holding a choice band. Alright, so let's go back. Let's move items. Okay, we got the choice band in our bag. Let's see what it's, who's going to be Gatorade?
If I can get this egg to hatch. Come on, hatch egg. I'll cut ahead to where I have the egg. Hatching. Okay, here we are, and let's see what we got. Let's see what Pokemon hatches out of this egg. It's going to be... A Totodile! Oh, I love it. I love it. Gatorade for the Totodile. Yes, I would love to give Totodile a nickname. So, for those of you that don't know, actually, because I don't... I don't think I said it. Um, Because I know I chose Totodile at the beginning of the game, even though we weren't going to use it, but... Totodile is actually my favorite, my favorite starter, and I just love Totodile, so let's go check out, I named, I named it Totodile. <laughs> Alright, well it's an adamant Totodile, it has Torrent with Dragon Dance, Metal Claw, Crunch, and Ice Punch. I think those are legit, uh, let me <laughs> double check it. Oh, I'm gonna have to go and, uh... I'll go back, I'll go into Pokegen and I'll change the nickname of it. I can't believe, I cannot believe I just nicknamed it Totodile. I had Totodile in my brain. Dragon Dance is an egg move. Ice Punch is an egg move. Metal Claw is an egg move. And Crunch is an egg move. Alright, so we have a legit Totodile, which is, its nickname is Gatorade. So let's get this guy to, uh, let's get this guy to level 5. Um, cause he is taking the place of the new mole that we encountered. Alright, level, level 2. And level 3. And let's see, level four, and one more level to level five. Okay, perfect. All right, so we got we got a little toad out. I'm gonna I want to put him at the front of a party, cause I love you, Goku, but I want to put this little guy, this little Gatorade, at the front of our party. Cause I'm thinking, I'm like, what Pokemon could be Gatorade? Cause Crocodile is not in this in this game. All right. So let's not go to my mail, my PC. Okay, let's go to back here and let's go to get uh, this. Nope, this core fish. It has adaptability too. Oh man, that's that's so nuts. Okay, so let's roll the dice. Let's go to row four, which we haven't picked out of yet, which is exciting. And Pokemon number four. Every time I go to a new row, I go row two. Column 2. Row 3, column 3. Row 4, column... It's nuts. Alright, so let's see what this is. We have a Dust Skull for the nickname. Uh, no item. So let's go out and I will meet you when it's hatching. Okay, this Dust Skull is taking a rather long amount of time to hatch. So maybe it's like a bad egg or something. So I'm sorry to whoever sent me this Dust Skull, but I, I've been running around for it for like 10 minutes and it's not hatching. So let's uh, find another one. I didn't even roll it. Five. All right, we got the last row. Four. That one. All right, so let's see what we got. We have I with TM20 holding TM26. AI, Porygon. Oh my god, I love Porygon. All right, uh. Alright, AI. So let's get that TM20. No way, that's not that's not Porygon. TM26 is Earthquake, isn't it? I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure TM26 is Earthquake. Yep, it is. Alright, so let's go outside and let's hatch AI. AI, what? Come on, egg. Ego my Lego. I mean, Lego my Ego. I mean, let's run upstairs. Alright, that egg will hatch soon. 
So... Alright, here we go. Let's see what it is. A Beldum! Well, well, well. I would love to nickname this Beldum AI. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do capital AI. Okay. Alright, Beldum. Let's go and let's check out this Beldum. Alright, it's an Adamant Beldum. Oh, so many of our Pokemon are Adamant. Adamant, 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 Adamant. Alright, so let's see. So we got an Adamant Beldum. He is somewhat vain with takedown. And I know for a fact that Beldum only starts with takedown. And, that, and that's it. It has Rockhead, so it re prevents recoil damage. Which is good. Which is good. So let's get this Beldum up to level 10. Uh, Alright. I'll be back in a second. I gotta put a speed up button on this thing. Okay, I put a speed up button only to <laughs> level these Pokemon up. And he learned Headbutt. At level 10. Alright, so let's take a look at our party. All of these guys are different types. That's perfect. Is, uh, Beldum is its Steel type. Okay. So we actually, we have Headbutt, so we can Headbutt trees. Which is good. Um, let's go out here. Let's run over here. Let's run inside the Pokemon Center. Let's see what we can buy. Uh, let's bring ourselves up to 10 potions. Let's go back to uh, 15 Pokeballs. Uh, no, you can't do anything else for me. So let's go up to you and see what you can sell us. Airmail and a heal ball. I don't want either of those. Alright. So let's go up to Route 30. Alright. Let's go and let's get our encounter. Da, 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 da. It's a Talo, but it's not really a Talo. Uh, let's just hit it with a Metal Claw. I don't know why it took me so long to decide what move to hit this Talo with, because we're not even... I don't, I don't know. I don't... <laughs> I really don't know. I... Oh! First crit of the game, and we don't get that one, so Route 30 is death. Alright, we don't get anything for Route 30. <laughs> Alright, let's uh let me actually run back down to the Pokemon Center and heal. Rest my Pokemon. Alright, I uh I love I'm sorry, so I'm gonna suck, suck my throat. I love Gatorade, but I didn't mean Goku. Let's actually switch Gatorade with Top Gun. Oh, let's actually go, uh, let's see if I can teach. Um, I have a lucky egg to give to Top Gun. I have a choice... A choice band to give to Totodile. I don't want to exit out. Okay, uh, I'm just confused because of Dragon Dance. Alright, so, and then Earthquake. Let's see if we can teach Earthquake to Beldum yet, which we cannot because I'm pretty sure Beldum just can't learn any TMs at all. Alright, so we're healed. So let us, we have, we have Top Gun out front, so let's go and let's run. Let me actually go to my bag. And take my bicycle and register it. So then I can press Y and we can get on the bicycle. Alright, Weedle. Alright, uh... Woo! That was a lot of damage. 
Okay, level four. All right, cool. I'm just speeding up through these battles in the grass because they're gonna take forever. Let me actually. Switch out to to- Poison my Totodile. Alright, Totodile, use Crunch. Wreck it. I say- I say Water Gun over Metal Claw. Just so that we have some stab, because I know Totodile isn't special. But, um... We actually have an Antidote. Which I'm actually going to use. No, not the potion. Alright. I'm going to use this antidote onto Gatorade. Um, so that. I don't like the bike, actually. Alright. Uh, let's get another green apricorn. Wig bump, bump, bump. Pop. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Yeah. Alright. Um, shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake your apricorn. Alright, uh, he still says the same thing. Alright, this is our first, well, second, real trainer battle where, um, the true test of the Nuzlocke is set to begin. Alright, so let's actually send out, um, send out two Spoopy. I just got lost, so I'm trying to find more Pokemon. Wait, you look weak. Come on, let's battle. Alright, little kid. Let's battle him. Youngster Joey, I'm Joey. <laughs> Go to Spoopy. Alright. Let's do a pair song. He's trying to crit me. This little Rattata is trying to crit. Okay. To Spoopy. I need you to have eyes of steel. And I need you to be able to hit this. Thank you. Thank you so much. After the first two battles that we throw you out in, you miss two hypnosises. Let's hit it with a Giga Drain. I just want to see how much this does. Alright. Giga Drain does a lot! I didn't even need Parish Song! Whoa! Alright, let's go out to Beldum. Because Beldum can take a hit, and we get, get, get a little bit of experience for Beldum. He's going to wake up. He's going to use Tail Whip. Oh, okay. So, zero faints. Okay. So, 42 experience. Two Spoopy grew to level 6. And 42 experience, which is... <laughs> that was so little! Oh, my gosh. Um, I don't want you to have my number, Youngster Joey. Come on. Alright. So now we have another trainer right here, but I'm actually going to wrap it up today. I'm sorry it took so long hatching those eggs and stuff, but um, we have that. So hit that like button down below if you like this. Uh, comment at answering the question of the day, which I forgot at this point, but I'm going to you know go back and post editing and figure it out. And um, hmm, let's see what else. Oh, oh, all the eggs that I hatched today. Thank you so much. Leave your name down in the comments so that I know which Pokemon that you had given to me. Um, I'm sorry for all the people whose eggs I could not hatch because the eggs just didn't want to work. I'm very sorry about that. Um, yeah, so I will catch you later. See ya.